By the way, I hated Chaucer. <laughs> I don't blame you. I we had tests in that class every every class. We had a quiz on what we'd read the night before before we started, so we could prove that we read it. And um, I got a, a B in that class without reading all but two sections of the class because I could not process how things worked at a speed that would get me done by the time I had to get to class. Um, it would take like four hours to read some of the things and I just couldn't process it in time So I got like maybe a third of the reading done <laughs> um, But the only ones that I liked were Sir Gawain and the Green Knight, which is an Arthurian story and The King Arthur stuff that we read because while some of it still had the old English spelling and stuff It was at least the kind of fantasy that I really really enjoyed Wait, does that have a plant that shoots out more of the thingies? Yeah. Those are just occasionally sit around in rest areas. Nice. Mango! Is it a mango? I don't remember. Hey, get back here. No, it's not. It's called something weird. It looked like it was called Muggle for weird. It is. Muggle. Hey you, I will buy your map. Why don't you buy something? Kill me. We'll buy something. Your map. <laughs> Why are all you shopkeepers so pouty? Because you bought their favorite map! How are they supposed to get out of here now? It's not like they're right next to an exit or anything. Muggle seeds require eight phosons. Yes. <laughs> Muggles are oval and kind of look like a mango. They can be consumed twice and heal the user with 30 hit points. Yes. After consumed, it leaves more seeds behind. Yes. They're one of the most common things I plant because I will always have seeds for it. Um, you can take him to the cafe and make recipes with him. Yes. And then the cafe is still 14 chapters away. Really? No, I just made up that number. <laughs> <laughs> it's like... When did I run into the cafe? <laughs> oh man, am I running out of things to do the thing with? What thing? Uh, Neon Mob. It's a trading card collecting website. I, I just can get voted in the collection. What? Where artists can get voted into making their own collections. I submitted a collection and it got like a third of the amount of votes it needed and then no one ever responded to it again. But nobody's on Neon Mob that I know, so I can't have anyone I know vote for it. Huh. It's a collection of flower photography, which means that Dark wouldn't vote for it anyway. Because he hates all plants. Doesn't he submit a lot of flower photography? No, he took a lot of pictures of flowers because his grandma owns a giant garden. So the heck is this thing? I don't remember this thing. An item from your Steam wish list is on sale. That's never happened before ever. My Steam wish list? No, mine. I have like 487 items on there. There's an item from my wish list on sale every minute of the day. I was about to ask what was on my Steam wish list, even. Do I have uh, a Steam Pokemon list? Adventure bootleg game. That might be on my wish list. Made by an exceptionally good violinist and no game programmers. Also, still might be on my wish list. 
Just because it has the word Pokemon in the title? No, because the weird bootleg of something that I know. And plus, you had the fact that it was made by a violinist, and that's just hilarious. I was very close. I have 483 items on my wish list. I was off by four. The only problem is the sales that go on on all of mine are 10% sales, and the whole reason that I can't buy them is because they're typically like 30 or 40 dollars. Oh no. Actually, the attachment controller again. Don't do that. Yeah, I don't want to do that. I have on my wish list a game called Holy Potatoes! We're in space? I actually don't see any items on my wish list that I like need to get soon. Like, none of them are ones that, like, I can't store any more items. I need to get some stuff. Oh, you got the mango buggles! So you just gonna have to eat them all, like... You need, just, you need to get your fairy fat, okay? She's not a fairy. Oh, that's right. She's a Valkyrie. Eight bit invaders. Legend of Merchant. Alright. No, still keep looking through your inventory because inventory is full, you're doing something wrong. You're not throwing Like enough... having all the healing potions. You're not throwing enough stuff at people. All my potions are healing potions. I don't think I throw those at people. Well, you could if you wanted to extend the battle. I'm gonna mix a whole bunch of healing potions into a not healing potion to make a stronger potion. Level 3 Cyclone Potion, because it absorbed all the healing potions. Ever. You're so full of fruits that you don't really need healing potions. Here's a game called Typo Man. What? You heard me. What's it about? A man. Does he type really poorly? No, he is a typo. Let's see if I can find that. If I remember correctly, it's like an action game. I don't know where it went. I scrolled down and then it disappeared from my wish list. What did I do? Visit store page. Which one was this? Oh yeah, this is the surreal platformer side scrolling thing. That you might actually like this one. Huh. You're a man made out of letters, and um, the world is affected by the words that are kind of floating around and stuff. So it's cool. I like it. It, it is so much done. The soundtrack was by Sonic Picnic. I'd buy that game, Sonic Picnic. Nah, the spin dashes ruin it. Um, pink you hour. Match deals everywhere. Yeah, but it's delicious. You just have to catch it when it goes fun. Where's that other one that I think looks really cool and has a clever idea, but apparently wasn't executed? <laughs> Exceptionally well, you know I I can't carry any more muggle seeds because I have too many. Well, just eat all your. <laughs> Can you merge them into anything else? Well, it, it's like I'm eating all the fruit, but I have too many seeds. They won't let me carry any more seeds. I know, and each one drops seeds. Yes. 
And I can't do anything else with them until I run into the... Cave? Mer the, sh the shopkeeper. Well, not the shopkeeper, but the... Cave. Restaurant. I haven't played any of them. Unless you count Salt and Sanctuary. It's the same company, right? Yeah. But I did enjoy Salt and Sanctuary. Which is Sonic the Hedgehog. Yes. If we battle, it will be a serious affair. You're hesitating. Bluffing will only get you so far. If you value your life, obey the king. You ignorant fool. You cut short your own life by meddling in my affairs. Using the crystallization cauldron will doom the entire world. That accursed cauldron served as a trigger. To the horror that befell my native country of Valentine. It is Cataclysm's womb, and it should not exist. The great magical country of Valentine is said to have been destroyed overnight. I am aware of the story that you describe. The Valentine prophecies say the world will be destroyed by five disasters. One of those five involves a furnace that spews despair. You say that line refers to the crystallization cauldron. Tis but a rumor from a ruined land. War will spread across the world. The winning country will rule over the entire land. Your country's ambition is merely a convenient lie for the demon lord. Do you imply that my king is deceiving everyone? I will not hear this mockery. Stop this nonsense! I shall take your life if I must! And fighting! I 
remember right, she actually uses potions against you. As well as swings around like Spider-Man. Bananas? Does she, is she scared of bananas? 